Building the perfect landing page can be quite hard. But worry not, as I've gathered nine ways that you can use right now to optimize the performance of your pages. First, write engaging copy. The reason behind it is that most people simply check your headline and then bounce from your website without performing the action we want, be either a purchase or a simple sign up. The way you do write a compelling headline is by combining these factors fear, desire, and curiosity. You don't need to meet all of them, but meeting at least one will spark an emotion and that will make people scroll your page. Following the example on the screen, you can see that the headline makes people want to know how Headspace achieved these results with Salesforce. And here we have a desire to achieve similar goals and some curiosity on how they did it as well. And by the way, did you notice that they are using Headspace for social proof? So that's a great technique that you can use as well. Second, include images or videos in your content. You need visuals to engage people. It doesn't matter on which business you are in, they will always be a big part of your brand. In Headspace, for example, see how they use their images to gain trust directly on the first part of their page. The images clearly show their product and you are much more likely to purchase than without proper visuals. And the reason for that is trust. Look at this comparison, and I'm sure we all agree that images play a key role on website conversions. Without the visuals, it wouldn't be engaging at all, but this applies to every page or website, including yours. This is why we provide free professional images from Unsplash that you can use on your landing page or website using GetResponse Website Builder. Third, make your call to action stand out. This is what you want people to do. Click on the CTA. You crafted good copy and added engaging visuals. Now what you need to do is to make sure your CTA stands out. To do that, you need a contrasting color against the background and a relatively large button. And of course, you need to specify what's the goal of the CTA, what will happen. You will then, of course, need to do some A-B testing on your own to find the best results. But you can look at these examples here and see that they all have one thing in common. Their CTA is standing out at the top. Fourth, make the lead form visible above the fold. Chances are that people arrived on your page from ads or a marketing email, and they are most likely interested in what you have to offer. To gain the most out of their interest in your product, adding a way for your visitors to leave their email address right at the top can be game changing. As you can see here in GetResponse, we do that. And that's why we recommend it as well for you so that you can build a high quality list. There is also something else that you can use, which is to show a pop-up on exit intent. So this is how you take the most out of people that might already be interested in your content. Fifth, offer something useful. This can be combined with number four, as you will have more success capturing email addresses when you offer something in return. We call these lead magnets. See here an example on how Segafredo uses lead magnets to capture emails. Offering a discount, as in here, is definitely a good lead magnet, and if you weren't buying coffee before, now you are. And they get your email address as well, so that's a double win striked right here. Just make sure that you are providing some value, it's usually something exclusive as well, and can be hard to get to, so that people will get hooked and leave their email address. Sixth, do not make excessive requests. No one really wants to feel a form full of information. It's a real turn off, let's be honest. In addition, people are generally wary of the amount of personal information they leave online, especially nowadays. And here in our example, as you can see, you can download our high quality lead magnet by just filling in three fields. Tie this to number four and number five, and if you are providing high value content, chances are your list will qu quickly grow as ours do. Seventh, appeal to the user's sense of urgency. Limited time offers are an effective way to leverage FOMO, which is the fear of missing out, and increase your landing page conversion rates. At the landing page level, you can add a real time clock that counts down the hours, minutes, and seconds left for the user to get lower prices or simply add information about when the promotion expires. Just look at what h and do 
and most brands are using the same strategy as well. Here's another example of Boohoo, and you can see a timer at the top as well, really driving this urgency. This is a great strategy that you can use, especially when running a big promotion as Black Friday. Once again, you can easily use our website builder to add a countdown timer and start running these promotions. 8. Make your landing page mobile friendly. One way of optimizing your landing page for mobile devices is by making it super responsive. Make sure page load times are optimal and all forms fields are easy to fill. Landing page images, videos and CTA buttons should also fit smaller screens properly and be easy to interact with. And you can easily do that with our GetResponse website builder. Ninth, make search engine optimization a priority. Tools like Keywords Everywhere and SEMrush can help you with keyword research. Once you have identified the right target keywords, it's time to incorporate them into your landing page content and meta description. Next, give your visuals some alt tags. These provide your images with some context, which is helpful for search engine crawlers. And meta descriptions are also critical. The description appears under your link when your web page appears in the organic search results. And good news is you can do that with our website builder as well. And that's it, folks. If you want to learn how to create a landing page from scratch, watch this video.